What's up, you guys? It's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. I just came back from the gym. I took a shower. Now I have my condition on this way. It looks kind of crazy, kind of creepy. Yeah, I did a smoothie. Such a weird day. Tomorrow is Christmas Eve, which is so crazy. Like, it happened everything so fast. I can't believe it. I can't believe I'm staying in Montreal for Christmas. If you live in Montreal or in Canada, I don't know how it's working, but here in Quebec, we are gonna start lockdown on the 25th. Like actually Christmas, nothing's gonna be open. No stores, restaurants, whatever, still gonna be closed. This is gonna be so crazy. Like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do actually. Like, I think I'm just gonna buy a book work out at home because the gym in my building is open but now it's different like we have to make reservations every three days i don't know and we cannot work out with a lot of people in the gym it's just you or if you live with someone else i have a roommate but still every three days is kind of like no consistent inconsistent so yeah today sorry about the mess because my roommates are moving moving she's living soon so she has to prep and pack everything but for now i have my nails appointment in like half an hour i'm gonna put i'm gonna show you which color i'm gonna get because i've never ever put that color in my life i always had like a bad conception of that color so but i'm gonna do it this time because you know yolo whatever so i'm gonna do that i have to go print a book because i got the book I will put the link down below because it's a book of health. The book of health is called, it's from Kayla Pomponium or yeah, I think I pronounced it right. She's a nutritionist, holistic nutritionist. So she created this ebook and I purchased it and I'm gonna start reading and going through it so as to like keep on touch or like to keep on going with my health. So yeah, that's what's going on so crazy so fucking crazy <laughs> okay, we just finished our nail appointment and i'm gonna show you like close because it's so cute i just like the christmas tree <laughs> Hello everyone, it is Christmas Eve and I just got ready to shoot my outfit later with baby. <laughs> so this is what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing this bodysuit from Zara. And it has an open bag. Melina pants from Maritzia. And shoes. I'm still in socks, but yeah, that's what I'm wearing now. Good morning, guys. Finally back. I'm still on my PJs. Look how cute they are. They're from Victoria's Secret. And I look so crazy and like my skin is just not having a good time. I think it's because of the cold and everything. My skin is very dry and it's like peeling, which is not good. But I'm making the most out of it. Now I'm just making some ginger tea and drinking some butter. It's like 10 a.m. But last night, oh my god, last night I have the worst belly pain ever. I couldn't barely like sleep well. It was so bad. So today I want to take in more like kind of into like the cleansing side so yeah i don't want to put anything heavy into my body now because my belly feels you know i'm debating if doing this ginger peach or doing the chamomile it's just like i don't have a lot of tea i wish i had more i have like 
wild berry or something like that a chamomile i don't have i just have this one i have to go buy some and i always heat up my water in that one the little i do not have anything planned for today so we'll see how what i'm gonna end up doing but for sure i have to do laundry for sure i'm gonna show you my morning skincare routine because i just got the product i needed to do so so i'm super excited and yes so this is like my morning station i have my water my peach ginger tea which i hope it is good i haven't tried in so long and my candle and then i have my journal i journal pretty much every single morning like i put many things into it i actually take it very seriously don't want to share anything so yes basically i put like how am i feeling everything that triggers me what I'm thankful for, some affirmations, some manifestations that's really important. Love it every morning. What's up, you guys? Wait, Alexa, turn down the volume. What's up, you guys? So I just showered, put my hair in a bun, and I'm gonna show you my skincare routine, which I'm so excited. So basically, I always start with a cleanser. Sometimes I cleanse my face when I'm in the shower. But this time I want to show the cleanser I'm going to use today. And it is the cleanser by Indulee. It's the student cleanser. I found this brand so clean and awesome for every single type of skin. Just because it, has contain, it doesn't contain any bad like chemicals or bad ingredients that will affect your skin. So basically, it works perfect with every single skin. I do use another cleanser I'm going to show you. Because, wait... <laughs> because I use the skin so it calls cleansers like the gel cleanser but this thing it's very strong I use it because I have acne prone skin but like if you don't have acne prone skin I feel like you should not use it because the ingredients are very strong so be careful with that but because my skin is spilling I don't feel like using that one like I really don't feel like to because I'm scared something's gonna happen so I'm gonna use my Indulee Soothing Cleanser what I do, okay, I literally just like wet a little bit my face like that and then I just rub it here and so like do that for like a couple seconds and I love this smell. The thing about this brand is just so clean and so I just found it perfect. They have amazing products and yeah, I just love it. I hear that like if you have like acne prone skin like oily skin i don't have oily skin but like if you do or like just because of the acne you should not be like um clean by like, cleansing your face in the morning i don't know why um, i feel like it's, it can like dry out your skin like pretty bad or i don't know the fact like sorry i feel i should try it once the only thing is like because i use retinol at night i want to take that off of my skin i feel it's too heavy sometimes even though i like it i feel i just should like wash it off wash it off is that a word is that expression so next step i use my acne pads this is something that my dermatologist recommend me because it contain it contains uh, salicylic acid is 2% so it's basically a lot you shouldn't put more than 2% salicylic acid on your skin because it will mess it will mess up your skin I swear so I do like little records when I do have acne I do have to put in my entire face but like I do like that it feels very fresh to be honest but it's it's, it's like hard sometimes it burns like right now it's burning nice nice and I do it like that. My entire skin. The smell, oh my god, it smells very chemical. Like if you use it, it's very chemical. But it's perfect. It's amazing if you had acne prone skin. I'm telling you, like, I feel every single person should use it. And like if you have acne in any other part of your skin, in your body, basically you can use it like if you have i don't know if you have like chest acne you can use it on your chest as well but yeah it's but the brand i didn't tell you so so skin oh wait so skin 
amazing product. Now I'll just live like guys I got new earrings. They're so beautiful. My mom gave them to me and I found them so cute. I love them. So after that, this okay. My dermatology dermatologist told me that this thing acts like a serum, but I still don't know if it's not true. Like I don't feel it. So I'm using the Vivier serum. This is it like the sample thing they gave me and i love it it's like oily <laughs> but i love it so nice everything i order from this place i'm gonna show you because it's the acne pots and the retinol but like everything i order from them it's by a local company in montreal called skin boutique skin v or something like that and they carry a lot of brands like Skin Surical, Skin Medica, Su Skin. They carry many brands for all type of like skin. Also, if you are into it, I highly recommend you to like try it. Okay, now after that, we move on to moisturizer, and I use the moisturizer by Skin Medica. It's the ultra sheer moisturizer. I don't like it as much because it's not. I don't feel it moisturizes enough or like i feel sometimes that i have to put a lot of product and that's just not great I, you know like i want something that moisturizes but at the same time gives me like i don't feel like i have to reapply i mean like this is doing its job it's hydrating my skin i can feel it's not the best probably it's the best for like oily type of skin but mine is like very dry especially for this weather Montreal is crazy weather. So, yes. Woo! After that, I just let it be for a couple seconds. Actually, for a couple minutes. No, I'm kidding. Probably just like when I'm putting this up, just organizing because it's important. I highly recommend this. Oh my god, if you have acne, tan skin, get it. Get it. But as I've been saying this plenty of times. If you have acne prone skin, and you're trying a bunch of products and you feel like nothing's working the best thing you can do is go to a dermatologist i swear it's life-changing you have to go they will know exactly what to do with your skin they will know exactly which products which chemicals which ingredients which uh mask you have to use uh they will tell you exactly how your routine has to be so i don't know i just feel like it will be a great investment that's something i did when i went to a dermatologist here in montreal i was like oh my god it's so expensive blah 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 but then i was like you know what? i've been spending like hundreds of like dollars in these products and nothing's working so i prefer to spend literally the same amount for one consultation and it was it was life-changing my skin has changed so much so I am so proud of it. Like proud of myself that I did it and proud of myself that I keep working on my skin health. So now last step is my sunscreen. Best sunscreen I've ever tried in my life. Elta MD. M M D. Oh my goodness. So French me. And yeah, just put it on my skin. Use sunscreen every single day of your life. Do it. Like don't regret it. You can have a beautiful skin always because yeah it's just a perfect sunscreen and that's it guys this is my morning skincare routine i love it i just love it um all the products i'm gonna link them down below because they're the best, of the best. and i'm gonna link to my favorite moisturizer which i'm gonna show you right now i don't have any more but it's this one by the brand oc osia i don't i'm not exactly sure how to pronounce it but i think it's oc osia whatever is the blemish ball it smells incredible it's like tea tree oil i just love that so yeah because everything is so empty 